hi guys welcome back to my channel i just woke up and i grabbed my coffee because my idea for this video is just to get ready in front of the camera to be honest with you i had a plan of doing like a do-it-yourself but the items that i ordered for it haven't arrived in time so instead of delaying it even more waiting for the items to arrive i decided to just turn on the camera and do a very chill video of me just getting ready in the morning and also today i will shoot with sofia after lunch so this will be like a get ready with me for shooting days so without further ado let's just roll the intro and start getting ready guys so i just got out of the shower and actually i already picked what i'm going to wear today because it's an outfit that i will shoot today that i was supposed to shoot last week but i ended up not having time to shoot it and i'm gonna show you it's an all black fit but i think it's gonna look very cute so the outfit is from pretty little thing and i have this shirt here which is kind of a very light jersey and for the bottoms i will wear these black trousers over here they're like a really light denim style of fabric and they come with this chain they are very cute so let's put the outfit on okay guys so this is actually the outfit the pants are so pretty i love when they are really wide and they get to fall on my shoes and also love this shirt it's very fitted very cute i always feel really really good and powerful when i wear an all black fit and also love the shoes in here okay so next step is to actually fix this mess over here i really need to do something to my hair and i want to do some pretty waves so let's do hair first and then makeup let's go all right guys so i'm ready to fix this mess of a hair and usually i use a flat iron or a curling iron depending if i want it straight or wavy but today i'm going to wear something else that i usually use when i'm in a hurry and that i really like as well which is hot curlers they are heating up right now and let me tell you that these bad boys are all af so these were from my mom so she gave me this and it's actually very helpful okay now to prepare my hair for the curlers i only need like a hairbrush and a hair oil so my favorite hair oil is the kizu honey infused hair oil i love this it's like a holy grail so i'm just going to put a bunch of it in my hand then rub your hands together and just apply I apply a lot of it because my hair is dry okay now it's more hydrated so let's just brush it and it gets shinier instantly so I really love this oil okay it's brushed and it's shinier so let's start curling this hair I'm gonna start on the top here and I'm going to use one of the bigger curlers they have like three different sizes I usually don't wrap the hair around until the roots, just around here because I only want it wavy on the ends of the hair. I'm using the bigger ones on the back. It burns, actually burns, you need to be careful. And I try to do like each side simultaneous so one side doesn't get more wavy than the other. And you keep doing this to your entire hair so there's not much science to this, you just wrap your hair around the curler and clip it at the end so do you like my new look this is how i look after all the hair is curled inside here and i'm actually going to curl my bangs as well just because i feel like it i'm just going to curl them like this and the final one here this is how i look <laughs> but yeah good news the hair will be preparing itself while I can do my makeup while wearing this so you need to see me looking like this for a while, I'm sorry and I actually will start with the brows and I will use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer in Auburn I definitely need to do my brows, they are looking so bad right now and I just realized this is not the shade for me sorry I have a bunch of this and sometimes I switch them alright I'm going to go with the NYX a feel and fluff feel and fluff in brunette oh much better this is much better 
And I just brush them all over so they can look like more like fluffy brows, although I don't have fluffy brows as you can see. Okay, I'm happy with this. Now I'm going to apply the La Masqua Skin Base Concealer and this is the shade L2. Guess what? My tan faded away really quickly. So now I'm shade number two. I'm just using concealer lately. I don't use any foundation. And then I start blending all this. I can't believe like this is what I look like on my YouTube channel. <laughs> All right, so I blended the concealer and before I set this, I will go with my Anastasia Beverly Hills lip palette and I'm gonna use this shade which is more like orange and I'm gonna use it as a blush. I'm just going to apply it here, the cheekbones, all right, like this and then on the nose as well. Okay, now I will use the powder and this is the Rimal Instant Fix and Matte Powder and I use a really thin layer of this and after this I will go with the bronzer. This is the LA Girl Pro Face Powder in the shade Toffee and I'll just add it here underneath the cheekbones and I place a little bit all over, just to give a little color to this pale face of mine and I'll add a lot underneath the nose because I want my nose tip to lift and I'll add it here on top to create an even more lifted nose tip. All right, now I'll add this ColourPop highlighter. This is the color Wisp and I'll just apply to the nose tip, lift it even more. We want the nose tip to the sky. And here as well, a little bit here on the Cupid's bow and most importantly, I don't wear it on the cheekbones anymore. I just wear it right here. I'm going to mix this red here with this vibrant pink. And I'll put just in the center like Korean style makeup. And I got back into this trend because I am watching uh, Itaeon class and I'm obsessed with this. I'm on the last episode, so don't try to spoil me because when this video goes up, I already finished the whole thing. And I'm just so obsessed with the looks like fashion and makeup and hair. So yeah, I highly recommend not only for the story, but I recommend as an inspo because all we are fed in our television here in Europe is like European and American uh, series and stuff and culture. So I like to look up for uh, different countries as well and see fashion and beauty from other uh, countries. And what I do next is to add like a lip balm. This is a Coca-Cola one, <laughs> um, but I just add a lip balm so the rest of the lips doesn't get like really dry. Okay, now I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Deep Brow Pomade in Auburn. This time it's the Auburn shade that I want. And it's like a creamy um, texture for the brows, but I use it for my freckles, fake freckles. So I'm just going to tap here in a bunch of places. And with a brush, I just tap them. So they look a little bit less dark. Now with the same bronzer, I will use it as an eyeshadow. And just apply here. Not too much, just a little bit to give some dimension to the eyes. And now with the same thing that I was using for the freckles, I'm going to add like a liner. The last thing missing from this makeup is actually mascara and this one is from Ico. it's called the Black Magic Mascara. Just going to add this and finish off this makeup look. Alright guys, so makeup is done and now it's time for me to remove all this from the hair and let's see what we have here. Oh pretty girls, oh pretty girls, pretty girls, sorry my accent. Don't mind if they are too curly like this because we will brush them into place. All right, so I removed everything, only the bangs missing. Let's take this one and this one. This actually looks so cute. I'm just going to brush everything in place and then mold it with your hands. All right, I added some clips here just to remove a little volume on this part while I apply my jewelry. But can you see how pretty these curls are? Now I'm going to add these hoop earrings, very chunky ones from H&M. Now a bunch of silver rings. I can't go out of the house without my rings every time I do. I feel so naked. So I have a bunch of silver rings and only some necklace missing. So I'm going to go with this one from Vitaly. It's very cool because it already has two layers. 
let's put on some perfume i like to do like the jonathan van has trick just slide into your perfume and we have our look so yeah guys this is it this is the outfit the hair the makeup i'm finally ready to go shoot after lunch and that is everything i hope you guys like to get ready with me today let me know if you like this type of videos if you want more vlogs i'm planning to add more vlogs and also i have a very exciting do it yourself coming up next week so keep tuned for that don't forget to subscribe to the channel we are at 99k we are so close to 100 so don't forget to subscribe and i guess i'll see you next week love you guys bye